Westbury and I'm the Genetic Services Leader for ST Genetics. Today we'll be going over an in-depth look of chromosomal mating and see how you can use it to make your herd more profitable. The goal of any breeding program is to increase profitability. There are several ways that we can do that. We can increase production, improve health traits, have a longer productive life, or improve fertility. The most important part of any breeding program is to select the correct bull team to help you in each of these areas. In the past, we used very basic mating programs. So we looked at the phenotypic traits of the males and the females to try to determine the potential for the offspring. So we would mate shorter bulls to taller cows to try to get an average between the two. But what we realized with corrective mating is that it didn't correctly and adequately look at the genetics of the animal. And we found that phenotype does not equal genotype. So we need to understand that a cow could be short but have genes to make her offspring taller. To better allow for the genetics to come into the equation of the mating program, we started using pedigree matings. And now that we have genomic information available on the dams and the sires, that's the most accurate information we can use to make mating decisions because these genomic evaluations are 60 to 70% reliable. Our chromosomal mating program is so unique because it is actually optimizing an economic trait while adjusting for inbreeding depression. So the way our mating choices are calculated is to increase a selected economic trait to the greatest potential in the next generation with the females provided by your dairy and the bull team that you select. So we're actually not maximizing each individual mating, but rather increasing the profitability of the next generation. The ST mating program consists of three types of matings, corrective linear, pedigree, and genomic. So corrective linear mating uses an Android mobile application uh, for us to score your animals and each of their phenotypic traits on a scale of one to nine. Our program then corrects the four least ideal traits for each female. If you have pedigree information available, we can upload that information to stgen.com and then our mating program utilizes a database that contains over 5 million pedigree records for males and females and we can trace back the lineage as many generations as possible to find that actual relationship between the mating pairs. In a genomic mating, we use the most up-to-date genomic information available based on that 17-digit unique ID for each female. We also use the genomic relationship file produced by CDCB to determine the actual inbreeding relationship between the males and the females. And this genomic relationship file contains over 5,000 bulls and 1.3 million females. Genomic matings are so valuable because they actually increase heifer value. So when compared with pedigree matings, genomic matings increase the heifer value by $84 and actually decrease inbreeding by 1.3%. If you compare genomic mating with random mating, it increases the heifer value $214 and decreases inbreeding by 2.9%. You'll also see improvements in conception rates by avoiding mating recessive carriers. Overall, the PPV allows for selection of the best mating pairs to maximize the profitability of the next generation. Within our chromosomal mating program, you have the flexibility to incorporate corrective linear, pedigree, or genomic information to produce the best mating solutions. For more information about the chromosomal mating program, please visit stgen.com or talk to your local representative.